This is KMTV 3 News Now. I'm Vanessa Villaforte with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. It has been six months since 12 year old Ryan Larson left school on May 17th and never returned home. Larson was reported missing by staff at La Vista West Elementary School around 1145 AM and he reportedly left the school during a passing period. A neighbor spotted Ryan around 1.30 that afternoon outside of the Southland apartment complex where he lived. There were surveillance cameras that picked up a person who police believe could be Ryan near La Vista Kino at 1.45, but they have yet to confirm it. La Vista Police Chief Bob Lawson talked to us about where the case stands now, and he says the longer a case like this goes on, the more suspicion of foul play increases. In response to Ryan's case, the La Vista Police Department launched the Take Me Home initiative. It's a registry for people with autism and other disabilities. It gives police quick access to critical information about a person who's missing. And you can register your child or family member by visiting cityoflavista.org slash take me home. Only police will have access to this information and you can upload a photo and information on the website or take it directly to the LVPD police station. There's a link to the registration site and a phone number if you have questions on your screen. And I'm 3 News Now meteorologist Chris Swain. Sub freezing overnight as we get into early Thursday morning. We'll have clear skies, a lot of moonlight as we approach a new moon. The full beaver moon uh, happens Thursday night into Friday. We'll also be a lunar eclipse, but that's early Friday morning at about 3 a.m. Winds out of the northwest up to 25 miles per hour will keep us breezy tonight and throughout the day on Thursday. Sunshine's back, cooler temperatures stick with us, uh, even a little bit cooler than what we've seen this week. 44 to 52 to 53, so above average by the time we get to the end of the week and into the weekend. Another seven day without any rain chances or snow for that matter. We stay dry. A lot of ups and downs, 50s, 40s, 50s, 40s, back and forth. Overnight lows generally sub freezing. A couple, at least mild nights, all things considered. Breezy conditions on Tuesday, clouds back by Wednesday.